What's up, collective? Welcome back to my channel. So I was shuffling and tomorrow flew out. Okay. Tomorrow flew out. Um, what I see here is we have ritual sacrifice at the bottom after shuffling. Okay. We have insanity. Somebody who's having delusions or hallucinations, somebody who's hysterical and possibly possessed by a demon. Okay, that's what comes across this channel. This person is very possible that um, they're going to be outside. I see peasant. Hmm. They, it, this looks like somebody who is um, living rural. Okay. Um, and then ritual sacrifice. So some type of sacrifice could take place tomorrow is what I have here. Welcome back to the channel. Um, there's new readings on the channel collective. There's uh, April readings for earth signs, water signs, and fire signs on the channel. Okay. Um, and over a thousand videos. Thank you for your likes, comments, and your subscribes. Thank you for supporting the channel collective. Um, let's get into this reading let's see what's going on here so um clarify uh let's clarify a uh, peasant the, the the rural living card hmm. somebody could be hunting this person i see hunter here this person could be hunting someone or someone could be hunting them i see peacemaker and mediator so Okay, this could be an ancestor or hmm. This is someone who's trying to trying to make peace or they're going to want okay, 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 okay. Okay. This is somebody who is possibly losing it, okay? They could be harassing you, all right? And they could be trying to make peace with you is what I see here because something is going to... I think this... Per, what I'm picking up is that this person knows something is going to happen to them. Um, they may not know what's going to happen tomorrow, but that's what the card says, okay? We're pulling tarot here. So let's, let's um, just roll with it here. Um... This person might be trying to make peace with you, okay? Because they're they're at a peasant status. Um, they're at a. I'm getting that this person is at a lower status than they were, okay? And they could be looking. Somebody could be looking to sacrifice this person, or they could be looking to sacrifice you, which is why they want to make peace here because they're about to be rural living, okay? Like this person is about to be. I see somebody living outside I, I or homeless comes out a lot for these energies. So it's possible this person's living status is going to change. I'll leave it at that. And they could be trying to make peace with you to sacrifice you or someone's going to sacrifice them. They either going to sacrifice you or somebody's going to sacrifice them. This person uh, could be going to court soon. Okay. They don't want to. So they need to offer up someone here. This person could possibly be a slave. Like I'm 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 telling you, I was channeling this uh a day or two ago. Somebody is um <laughs> in some bad shape. Um hmm. let's see what's going on here. Clarify enslavement, work slave. A concubine, possibly. This person could be like getting pimped. I, I just keep picking up somebody getting pimped here. Um, abused. Needs medication came out the other day. Okay, some type of... Okay, so... Okay, so when I picked up... When I clarified enslavement, animals came out. So this is possible that somebody could have been 
doing this to animals, treating animals very badly, and sacrificing them. That's what I see here, okay? So that they can possibly get out of jail or get out of court. Um, I also see this person trying to like hustle you, okay? Like trying to deceive you. Um, hmm. The government is involved with something this person is doing here. Yeah, this person is getting pimped with the money handler card. Uh, this could be some sort of artist or some type of creator or something. But they're getting pimped with the money handler card. This is my pimp card. It's just how it's been communicated with me with the other cards around it. So this person's getting pimped, basically. Um, they're some sort of slave or they're, it could be spiritual slave, a spiritual slave or a physical slave, but some type of, something strange is going on with this person. Um, I don't know, collective. This, this energy is very strange here that's been, in the collective's energy. Just strange cards are coming out for this energy. Strange cards. Let's see what's going on here. Let's try to unpack this. Um, clarify this pimp card, enslavement, um, ritual sacrifice. What's going on? Yeah, this peacemaker card kind of threw me for a loop but this person is trying to it's like I feel like this person tried to attack you and it didn't work so now they're trying other routes and they're still attacking you but they're it's like they keep going in between attacking you and trying to get along with you they don't know what to do like this person is literally insane here that's what I feel okay cigarettes could be relevant they could be smoking a lot, okay? A strip club could be relevant. We do have sex and pimp. Tried and failed. This person is failing at whatever they're trying to do. Yeah, they're stalking this, okay? Because they want your future. This person's possessed by a demon. The husband knows. So this could be somebody who was cheating on their husband. And doing, having this type of, I feel like this is somebody who is living two lives here. They're living two lives. Yeah. They could have some type of personality disorder. Kentucky or a place that starts with K. Ain't nothing going, child, there's nothing going on. This person's mind is blank. I don't know what's going on with this person here. Okay, somebody is getting beat down. Somebody could be getting abused. <clears throat> They're trying to attack my throat shock for one moment. <coughs> mm. I just saw mentally ill and black magic here at the bottom. So incubus energy is involved. Um, black magic is, is involved here. A second date. Somebody could be trying to attain a second date. They could be trying to steal something from you, something you created. They can't forgive themselves for something they did. So they're doing something really bad here. Somebody might have needs to get a lawyer or has gotten one. And this person is ex experienced a decrease in spiritual ranking because they are doing some low vibrational spiritual stuff. Okay. June could be relevant. Gemini could be in this person's placements. Okay, or they could be seeking out this energy, this positive magician energy. Hmm. <sighs> hmm. Hmm. Clarify birth chart. Tried and failed. Tomorrow. Clarify tomorrow. Let me clarify tomorrow. Clarify tomorrow. 
Yeah, we got Aquarius energy. Okay. Um, this person is avoiding transitioning some into some sort of mental clarity. We did have a card that said this person is going insane. So this card in reverse is insanity, confusion, brutality. In the upright, this person is avoiding going into clarity. They, it's like this person is stuck in insanity and does not... I keep getting that this, this energy does not want to heal. They don't want to heal. They, they, they're avoiding a healing process and... They have a lot of emotional baggage and they're trying to drag this like this person wants company in this misery until it's their time is what i'm hearing this person is mm. so um tomorrow mm. Some type of new conflict is going to happen tomorrow for this person. Um, hmm. Some type of... Uh, you might experience some type of mental clarity about this person and why they're resistant to change. You might gain some clarity on this. Clarify tomorrow... Right, confirmation with the moon in reverse. You are going to gain some kind of clarity, okay? Um, this person keeps trying to um, get together with Scorpio energy to do some type of whorish act here, okay? That's what this person keeps trying to do. Okay, and they keep misinterpreting things. Like you're not interested in doing anything with this person here. They're they're just not this person is very gun ho on getting you to have sexual contact with them spiritually. They could be trying to get a second date with you, they could be trying to sleep with you because this incubus here or the succubus wants your energy, they want something from you. Okay, this is this is some sort of evil witch here who does rituals, okay. This person is definitely possessed by a demon with that card that said insanity. Um, this person wants to... Uh, <laughs> this could be somebody from your past. I'm getting this is somebody from a past life. Um, that has reappeared in your life through a divine connection, possibly. Okay? Um... They could also be trying to interfere with a reconciliation that you have with someone else, with these three parties. They keep trying to engage sexually with two people that want to be together. They keep trying to be this whore in the relationship, which is only in their mind. Because if it's just you and this person, this person is trying to force themselves into your life. They're trying to... Uh, interfere and force themselves with sex using sex and drugs and whatever aggression and sodomism I'm, I'm telling you that's what this person is doing that's why they're having a decrease in spiritual ranking um clarify tomorrow please you could be reconciling with someone tomorrow or getting mental clarity about it clarify tomorrow Yeah, this person is, is really after something here. So you may very well have Ten of Pentacles in your future. And this person, this Aquarius Capricorn energy is after it. They're stalking with tarot cards, doing spell work. They're obsessed with getting, like they, they can't, they can't let go. Okay, the husband knows means that these people could have cheated on this person in the past. Okay. And they, this, the husband moved on, okay? With the Six of Cups, the husband moved on to someone else and wants to be with someone else. Ten of Pentacles says they want to be with someone else. 
Not this crazy fucking maniac that's insane. Knight of Swords in Reverse and the Insanity card. This person is going to court for sure. Okay? The uh, a Governor card came out. So this person is going to be governed and under some sort of... Um, too many oaths of the devil here. Too many oaths of the devil this person made with this Virgo in Reverse. Using their judgment in reverse. To do, again, more punishment. Okay, judgment in reverse is about punishment and ignoring the call. Okay, these people are not uh, paying attention to uh, this, the red flags here. They're not. They're hustling, okay? Um, they're doing bad things for money. And they're entertaining the devil. They're overcommitted to the devil. And they're about to be under arrest or put to rest in some type of solitude with the four swords. Because of, they threw, Queen of Cups fell on the floor, okay? So they throw on Queen. They don't like this Queen of Cups energy, okay? And it's because their relationship is over. That's why. Because of these three parties, okay? So they don't, they're not very fond of this pentacle energy, this earth energy, this water energy. They're not very fond of it. They could also be having an issue with someone with Libra in their placements as well. Or Virgo. Or Queen of Pentacles, yeah. This, this this Queen of Swords is obsessed with this Queen of Pentacles energy. They keep trying to um, attain this person. They keep trying to possess this person. They keep trying to seduce this person um, with magic and spell work. Using music or anything else that they can use to try to uh, draw this person into them, which is probably never going to happen these people are so stupid okay something is really wrong with them clarify this queen of swords in reverse what the hell is her fucking problem these people are crazy this person is like fucking ridiculous yeah they don't they don't this person is, is depressed hopeless okay they're being haunted by the ancestors but they won't stop it's like this person is in a, a, a cyclical pattern of doing the same shit every day Okay, this person doesn't do anything else but the same shit every fucking day. This person don't do nothing else but the same fucking shit. Nine of Cups in reverse and Nine of Swords. This person is almost done. Okay, whatever they're fucking doing, they're almost done. They're being traumatized and they still get up and do the same thing every day. It's like this person is in some sort of pre-hell. They're, they're in some sort of pre-hell. They're extremely materialistic, greedy. Okay. They don't have a, a way out. With the Nine of Cups in reverse, there's no way out. This person has a drinking problem, okay? And they're depressed and they're worried and scared. They're going to jail, okay? They're going to jail. They can't sleep, okay? They can't sacrifice you with this hangman in reverse. They can't cause any delays in your life. They can't cause any standstills. They keep trying every day. They're attacking whatever they can. Okay, so anything that you're producing that this person can affect, they're, they're trying to attack it. Whether it's your work, your home, anything they can try to do uh, without getting caught because they're fucking cowards, and they're doing it. These people are going to court and going to jail and they're still committing crimes every day. These people are stupid. And they deserve whatever fucking karma they get times a million. They deserve the worst karma in, on the planet. They do. Because these are the type of people that don't, don't stop. Okay? Like, they just keep doing the same. They try and fail every day. It's like a repeated cycle. Okay? And they're working with this high priestess in reverse energy, which is all about harming people, being a whore, um, secret agendas, and lies. So it's like a group of these people just doing dumb fuck shit. And tomorrow, they're going to experience something very bad. It's, a, it's a several different things they're going to experience because there's several, several different people here. 
but I would say it definitely involves prison, being under arrest, put to rest, some type of reckoning on their life with the judgment card, some type of punishment, uh, some type of uh, lack of control, court, uh, a a warrant. So, something is going to happen tomorrow for these people. Okay. Somebody is trying to maintain control over this person's new beginning and it's not working. This fire sign here. Okay. They're trying to um, challenge this person. Okay. They're feeling challenged as well. They're trying to compete with this person as well. Yeah. But they're also trying to protect themselves. They, this person is, is like fucking weird, okay? They feel very defensive, but they want to control you. I, I, this person is just a weirdo. Mm. Yeah, they're avoiding some sort of painful ending. Uh, they don't want to recover. They, 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 they don't want to go up. Like It's like this person doesn't want to change. Um, they're insecure. Very insecure. And they're doing some bad things in the dream state. Uh, over emotional. And they're, they're, they're constantly trying to come up with new ideas on how to get this Knight of Pentacles and Six of Pentacles energy. Th their ideas are terrible. Okay? It's just going to leave them in regret and sorrow. That's all that's happening for these people. Nothing good at all. Nothing good at all. Hmm. it could be drinking and driving okay soulmate in reverse this is not a soulmate they could be working with a mag demon okay strip club twice so confirmation somebody either came from this environment is going to go back into it or works there they could have been doing this behind somebody's back okay they could have been harvesting energy from customers at a strip club is what i'm getting by having sex with them and doing spell work on these customers in private rooms and not of course not disclosing this okay um they won't go to the divine for forgiveness somebody will be contacting you very soon okay you can clarify that Someone is see okay seeking to offer somebody up here like that. That's that's what came out in the first cards. Mm -hmm. Harrisburg or a place that starts with R. May, I'm sorry, H. Earth sign, okay. Reclaiming your time from this person that secretly hates you. Yeah. Uh, clarify. I'll be contacting you very soon. Who was this? Let me. Clarify, I'll be contacting you very soon. A bully. <laughs> this bully wants to contact you, okay? They're looking for an easy target. They're looking for uh, maybe a fly monkey, okay? Is thinking about contacting you tomorrow. Okay, you might hear from a flying monkey in your family or a, a karmic. Okay, this tormentor. Hmm, looking for a scapegoat. They're looking for a way out. I'm telling you, do not interfere. Uh, do not get in, get into it with these fucking clowns here. Mm -hmm, they're going to court and they're sick. Look at that. I can't. The court card came back out because that's where they're going. That's where they're going. And they're sick. That's why they want to contact you. They want to do a ritual. <clears throat> They're, uh, they could have some type of genetic disease, but like I said, I think this person is... Um, they're possessed, okay? And they're lacking energy. They can't... They're, they're going through withdrawal, okay? You might hear from somebody who wants to be romantic with you tomorrow as well, okay? There's a couple, couple, couple people reaching out tomorrow, Couple people reaching out. 
And this could be any form of communication, okay? Think outside the box in forms of communication. Let's see, what else? Clarify out we got packing you for tomorrow. It says soon. It says very soon. Okay, so tomorrow or very soon. <laughs> okay. Somebody who's obsessed, okay, an obsessed love might be thinking about reaching out to you. Give me one more. Who else is, uh, oh, the courts might be reaching out to you. Okay, I could read it like that as well. You might be hearing from someone that is sick. They might be calling to tell you that they're sick or something. I can read it that way as well. And then we have somebody who's been exiled, shamed, banished from somewhere. They could be reaching out to you too. These people need somewhere to stay. I'm telling you, a lot of people are losing their homes because of uh, this. Okay, they, they shouldn't have got involved with some, something here. That's what I'm getting. I don't know, but that's what I'm getting here. Um, all right, let's get a couple more cards out of here, and then I'm going to do the letters and the numbers. We have false identity, and somebody is surrounded. Wow. Wow. Mm. Greece or a place that starts with G could be relevant. Mm. Somebody with a false identity is surrounded. L, M, N, O, P, or Q could be one of their um, initials. They look down on you, this person. They could have abandoned their apartment. Wow. Wow. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Um, just so a fashion designer could be relevant. Doesn't have to be. Hmm. This person is overly aggressive. Okay. Um, a security guard could be relevant. High income. They could be looking for high income to security guard. Elemental PQ could be one of their initials. Doesn't have to be. It could be. Let's see what's going on here. Um, hmm. Clarify surrounded. Okay. Some type of... Um, somebody could be trying to get some type of payback or revenge on this person. Um, hmm. Injustice overturned. But they're guilty. They could be trying to sacrifice someone here. Hmm. Clarify surrounded. A city dweller. They could be dwelling in the city, moving around on foot. Um, hmm. This person could own a shop. Uh, they could be like a working class person. Um, hmm. Or a socialite. They could be on social media. If I surrounded, wow, okay, they could have hurt somebody, like, um, they could have drowned somebody, or they could be out on the water. This keeps coming out. They could have drowned somebody who was very intellectual, or an inventor, or somebody very smart. They could have drowned somebody like that, they could have hurt somebody like that. Or surrounded. They could be surrounded by a body of water. They could be somewhere where there's a lot of water. They could be on a boat. Boat keeps coming out. It keeps uh, two of the, the, the cards that have water and boat. They could be surrounded by a body of water here. Okay. They're definitely distancing themselves and isolating themselves with the, the hermit card. This person here. Um, hmm. They could be helpless or trying to destroy somebody with the fool here this could be an aquarius energy and they could be doing trying to do this here or they could be a victim of this and then again look what we have at the bottom hmm
Please clarify murder. Helpless maiden. Lost at sea or drowned or surrounded by water. Clarify these cards, please. Okay, so there is, um, you can be an earth sign, okay, that's dealing with a negative earth sign. You could be earth sign in the upright dealing with negative earth here, this whore. World card in reverse is a whore, okay. <clears throat> Open portal for, for demons. Whores in the spiritual realm. Okay, possibly on the internet. <clears throat> uh, they're in regret. Okay, uh, about a murder possibly. What this is also like my funeral card. So somebody's is is going to be at a loss here. Maybe a Scorpio energy possibly is going to be uh, at a loss, or this this Earth sign in reverse could also be disappointed. Um, hmm. Clarify murder, please. They could have tried to murder this earth sign or this high priestess. You can read it like that too. Um, but they're, they're scared. Okay, again, nine of swords in reverse. This person is very scared as something that they did. Okay, they could have poisoned somebody or just something like that. Just somebody who was very intellectual or smart person or somebody who reads a lot, an inventor. They could have sacrificed somebody like this here. With the ritual sacrifice at the bottom of the deck. We need more here. They could have abandoned their apartment to, to, to escape. This person is wanted. Yeah, look at that shit. They can't get a demon attached to this Queen of Pentacles energy. They can't do it. Okay? They can't they want to attach this demon to this Queen of Pentacles energy to cause delays. Okay? Yeah. They want to. create indecision in this person like they want this person to not be able to make decisions on their own maybe so that this person cannot control their money yes yes that's what it is they want this person to not be able, they, they want to come in they want to cause a problem in this person okay and then they want to come in and say this person can't they can't make decisions your honor um we're going to need to take it from here because this person, they, they want, they're trying to do spell work on somebody so that this person is like unable to get something, get their money or something I'm getting. They want this person to be indecisive, like, like stalling and, and at a standstill, like just not in their best self. Okay. And, and attaching a demon to this person, attaching addictions and toxic and, and, and over sexualization and, and codependency on this person will do that it will uh fuck up this person's money so that they could do a ritual and turn around and take it they want to be a fucking page of pentacles they're tired of being a washed up whore they really are they're about to get it their opportunities are in reverse and their little fucking dream state sexual whore experiences are doing nothing for them they're not finding any new love. They're not getting any type of uh, intuitive messages back. Nobody's responding to them. They're, they can't get any opportunities from the dreamer. They're having a painful ending and an ace of pentacles in reverse. They don't have any plans. They don't got shit going on. They keep trying to surround this page of cups. Hmm. For high income. They want high income. A security guard could be doing this. Somebody's overly aggressive. Overcommitted to the devil with the two of pentacles in reverse. Overwhelmed. Overcommitted. Overly aggressive. This person's over the top. Everything's over. It's over for this person. Literally. Okay. This king of pentacles in reverse. Lower Virgo Leo energy. It's over for these people here. They're greedy and disgusting. 
yeah, they're suffering and grieving and fighting, okay? There's a lot of tension going on between these people. They can't, they can't get you. They won't stop trying. Clarify fashion designer. Hmm. Clarify fashion designer. Okay, we have Ace of Cups energy, which is about love and compassion. Okay. This Virgo energy, Virgo water, we have a water sign, you have Virgo earth energy, you have Taurus. Okay, somebody could be a fashion designer or be in this uh, industry. Okay. Um, you could be recovering right now from financial a financial loss of any type. Uh, you could be uh, improving. Something could be improving for you in this. That's what I see here. You're enjoying your fruits of labor as well. Some of you. So some of you are improving financially. You're getting help or charity. Some of you are enjoying your fruits of labor. And some of you are in love. Some of you are getting married when it comes to this fashion designer card. Okay, some of you are exiting and transitioning uh, into something here. Uh, you could be going to court with this Knight of Swords that it's over with. All right. The authorities are on the way to get this person. I'm telling you, this Knight of Swords, they're coming for you, Knight of Swords. They're coming for you because you're crazy. Some type of uh, departure is going to happen for this Knight of Swords. They're going to be departed to fucking prison or something. I'm telling you. Some type of action or movement is coming towards this person. Mm -hmm. Some type of control, uh, discipline. That's what the, the, the chariot is about. Some type of discipline is coming for this person. And it has to do with court. Okay? This person that the relationship is over with, it was just about the sex here and not much else. You are leaving this person. Somebody with Aquarius is leaving this energy. They're departing from this energy. Hmm. hmm. So we have the ancestor here in the center, in between this tower in reverse. What I see here is that somebody is trying to end something they don't want you going towards your ace of cups all these cards are behind each other they don't want somebody doesn't want this person with aquarius going towards this ace of cups this new love here but the ancestors are keeping the tower up so that you can it can happen okay and they're they're making a way for freedom here they're keeping it free like they're they're not allowing anybody to touch this here Okay, um, they could also be helping you spiritually with self-acceptance and releasing negative thoughts when it comes to this relationship. Um, this card is also in reverse. It's about opening up new perspectives and opening up your, your eye. Okay, uh, ancestor could be helping you spiritually with that and keeping the tower up on your relationship uh, because somebody's trying to bring it down. Like somebody's trying to destroy your Ace of Cups. Your spirituality, your self-love, your love for somebody else, they're trying to destroy it. So your ancestor is here protecting you and helping you release uh, negative thoughts and self-limiting beliefs is what I see here. Hmm. Clarify this romance card. So there's this negative Virgo, uh, Taurus, Gemini energy that has a problem with your romantic relationship here. You have a problem with it. They're not happy. Okay. You could have Virgo or Libra in your placements or Leo. All right. This group is, has a problem as well. Okay. 
with these two energies here. They may not necessarily be together, but they each are in a romantic relationship or have romantic feelings for someone in this group. And these jackasses here have a problem with it. They have a problem with it. Yeah, they want to destroy it with magic here. This this terror terrorist. That's what this five of uh, this cucaracha terrorist. Yeah. They have made oaths with the devil to try to keep you stuck, and they end up stuck themselves. Okay. They are um working without reward. Mm-hmm. Things are coming back to them here. All right. They want you to be indecisive. Always, you know, not sure or making blind decisions. That's how they can avoid an ending, is if you're staying in the state of indecisiveness. But they're experiencing delays, though, so it's not it's not happening. You're, you're there's nothing indecisive about you. You're you're very sure, so it's not. That's why they're having delays right now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ace of Swords, okay. And this negative energy here is, oh, this could be an X, okay, with the four wands in reverse. This negative earth energy is just, um, they're under judgment. This negative Taurus energy is, okay. They want to get this star in a uh, three party so they can deceive you and take from you. Take your opportunities with sex. Can't make it up. Can't make it up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they want to swap futures with you here. Mm hmm because you're strong you're strong so they're trying to get romantic with you yeah they want to get romantic let's um let's get the letters Somebody could have gotten their money seized. Be happening tomorrow. Okay, let's get um I have the letter J P here. They could be relevant. They were at the top of the set. We have we could reverse these numbers. We got 48, 3, 21, 31, 78, 87, 97, 15, 50, 85, 83, W, E, T, wet. Okay. Um, that could be significant. Met, Q, D, P, A, K, Pack, I, somebody is sick, <clears throat> somebody is packing, somebody could get shot. Uh, F, J, a tip. Somebody could be getting a tip about something. Sid could be relevant. Um, A, K. Z is here. Um... Somebody could be getting dissed right now. In the media. Somebody be getting dissed in the media. Um, 
um, something might happen at somebody's pad at their apartment or something. Mick or Mike, Mike is out. Um, that came out a few times this week. Mike, Cat. Cat is here, K-A-T. Um, Dick is here. Ditsy. Somebody could be very ditzy. Airheaded kind of right now. Um, or always like that. A pew could be relevant. Map. Map could be relevant. J and P is also here, so their age or their year could be here. You could reverse the numbers as well. Um, these are pretty uh, high numbers. Mm hmm. Mex Mex Mex. Mm. I'm gonna go with Mexico. Mexico could be relevant. Mr. Misty Patrick Pat Patricia Pam Pamela Kid Maybe this person's kid might be relevant Six somebody could be six Six months, six years, six days. Hmm. Kiss, kiss is here, kisses. A jet, a jet plane, a tide, a tidal wave, or tidal wave. Dis, disic? Feminine, divine feminine, divine masculine. Something can happen on a set. Something can happen on a, a, a set. A movie set or a TV set. Um, hmm. Fiscal, fiscal could be re relevant. Fiscal, um, a desk, something could be at a, at a desk. Pasadena, distance. Paid, paid is here. Miss or Missy. Betty. Jazz. Jasmine. TJ, 
JD, Zach, Tacky, Wedding, Maid, a maid or a housekeeper. A maid is relevant. Yeah, that keeps coming out. <laughs> Confirmation. <laughs> yeah, that that this that maid shit. Let me let me clarify that. Something is going on with that maid or that housekeeper. They're monitoring and stalking. Okay, or the, or they're being monitored and stalked. I just saw abusing me Norfolk. Okay, this maid could be in Norfolk. Black be a black person could be involved with an air sign or be an air sign mattress this person could be a hoe in a hotel room a sex addict karma is hitting this person quick visit is like a term for um prostitution okay female family member yeah Karmic stalking friends online. They could be stalking your friends online. Wanted you to come around so they could unalive you. Okay. Pure. They wanted somebody pure. Okay. Because you're perfect. You are the perfect person for them to offer up. They wanted you to come around to seduce you. Okay. Hmm. Person's initials could be in these letters or their age or something. I just saw a C, overweight. This person could be overweight, pitiful. Santa Barbara could be relevant. They could be lonely or a place that sounds like Santa Barbara. They're lonely because you're making wedding plans. Your ex got a karmic pregnant, could be relevant. Near home, near your home. Your ex got your karmic pregnant near near home. Somebody's under house arrest. A pile of clothes could be significant. House arrest, pile of clothes. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, house arrest near home, pile of clothes. Your ex got a karmic pregnant, Santa Barbara. A Leo. Someone could have Leo in their placements. Aquarius. Okay. You have Earth energy, Aries, <clears throat> Taurus in the upright. Okay. More Taurus energy. This Taurus wants to reconcile with Scorpio. Somebody does not want that. They're making very evil decisions. This Libra in reverse. It could be under house arrest or doing something with what on, on one of these cards here underneath. They could be prostituting themselves. Hiding something in a pile of clothes. Karmic is pregnant. Somebody needs to have sex with the Ace of Wands. They need to create. They need energy. They need to energy harvest. They're suffering because somebody's a Ten of Pentacles here and they're not. They're not. They're suffering. They're sorry. They're in pain. They could be crying a lot. Yep, they're out in the cold with this Queen of Pentacles here, this Libra energy. These people really did some bad things here. Mm -hmm. They really regret lying and deceiving someone. This Aquarius Scorpio energy. They really regret it. They're, they're Okay, the ancestors, yeah, is, is giving them karma right now with the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. All right, they're going through a really negative time in their life right now. Mm-hmm.
So those signs could be involved with these cards and the need here. All over money, wanting to take from you, trying to steal charity <laughs> instead of receiving it. Um, yeah, this negative energy here. It's just the same shit. All right? They're not having any success, but in prison. That's where they're going to be. That's your reading.